Yeah. Yeah, there it is right there. <laughs> yeah. I get a lot of satisfaction out of that, I gotta tell you. <laughs> I get a lot of satisfaction out of that. That's good, right? Just takes you back. <laughs> Right up there with the GameCube. GameCube startup's pretty good. So is PS2. That one's pretty good. Thank you, Paul, for 100 bits. Still muted you, though. <laughs> oh, there's one. <laughs> he got an extra. <laughs> there you go. Uh, look at this guy. He's like, I'm going to get more in. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> Uh, all right then number oh nine nine thank you for 400 bits we're getting we're getting all of it yeah oh i can't go that way one of your ps1 still works that's a good question one thing a lot of people i've found have not realized um if you have a ps3 number right oh nine nine a ps3 and ps1 games a ps3 and ps1 games all ps3s will play playstation 1 games all of them every single one of them number 099 i've had people in chat kind of lament that they can't play playstation 1 games anymore so i was like you do you have a ps3 and they're like yeah i'm like there you go <laughs> pop them in and go to town that's all you gotta do <clears throat> you put a new knock to a fan on your fat ps2 does that help number 099 what is that does that help we're getting some ps1 asmr we definitely are thank you paul that's a lot of bits man your PlayStation works, but you ran out of space, so you use your PS2. I mean, that's fair. PS2 is like near perfect uh, recreation of um, number oh nine. It's like a near perfect recreation of of the PlayStation One. It's damn near perfect. It's the the graphics engine is emulated but it's in-house emulation and it's like 99% compatibility. So it's, it's, they did a really good job with it. You have a PS3. Yeah. Put your PlayStation one discs in it and they will work. Um, I recommend when you put the disc in, you can go to the options. I think you push like triangle and there's like texture filtering option. You want to turn that off because it's going to add like a fake smoothing filter to it. Uh, and it's going to make it look kind of blurrier than it, than it should. So I recommend turning that off. If you play any of them, your PS3 needs some kind of cooling help. I haven't used mine in years. Like, I think it's been four years when I played or streamed last of us when I was not a retro streamer. You want to mod in software emulation on your fat PS3. Software emulation for what exactly? <clears throat> Your PS3 is all set to go and sweep it and load it up. Right on, dude. It was so loud. Now it's quiet. Yes. I make it loud when I do it. <laughs> when it gets spam like that, I just turn it down. <laughs> I don't want to shout over shit. Number yeah, filtering off. Look, a cool hero. Where? Where not? Stop. I don't know how much that was, Paul, but thank you, man. That was really nice of you. That was really nice of you. Bam, bam. Cancel the action back up. Right. What does that mean? We're going to wait on that one, Paul, but I will get to that. Thank you for playing that stream loots card. We just started the game, so interruptions are going to wait for a good 30 to 60 minutes. 
There were only like three PS1 games or something like that, which wouldn't work on a PS2. Yeah, there was very few. I encountered one bug. Uh, if you're playing on a PS2, that is. I encountered one bug. Um, playing Xenogears on a PS2. There's a certain boss that will hard lock every time on a certain move that it uses 50% of the time if you play Xenogears on a PS2. I managed to get lucky on the third attempt and I have to draw mice. Yeah, we will definitely get to that. I will I will get to that one. Yeah, for sure. That's going to be weird. <laughs> Number 099. Yeah, the day is fight. That's it. Yeah. Uh, as far as PS3 goes, I know it has a little more compatibility issues with PS1 games, but there's still so few of them that you're basically going to be fine. So, yeah. The first couple of versions of PS3, 40 gig and 60 gig hard drives had PS2 hardware or mix of software emulation. Right, Number yeah. 099. Yeah, that's correct. Yes. It was loud, now it's quiet. Oh, that's why you put it on. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. I was, I was getting that mixed up with Weiss. Number 099. You read it's a possibility to enable software emulation on PS3s for PS2 that don't have the hardware emulation for it. Oh. Number 099. Oh, okay. Got it. That's interesting. I'd like to see that happen if you could do that. <clears throat> How is that thing flying in here? Uh, wizard did it. Karma, wizard did it. Uh, did you hear Final Fantasy 8 had some issues with PS2? I don't know. I've never played it on a PS2. <clears throat> you had a problem with Final Fantasy 7 greatest hits on your PS2. Could never get into the first fight. Had to use regular FF7. Interesting. Interesting. One of them is Warriors of Might and Magic. Zordon on a PS2 or a PS3? He's a good pilot. Yeah, I like that's a good answer too. You can fly through the, you know... You could thread a needle with that thing. Hi, Elixir. Video wizard, Over thank you. It's all downhill from here for name L U L. Thank you for 40 months. Over the hill, nice. Technically, yes, I am, aren't I? <laughs> gotcha, Zordon. PS3, okay. Personally, I wouldn't have that issue because I don't use my PS3 for anything. But that's good to know. <clears throat> You've done easily five playthroughs of Final Fantasy VIII on your PS2, most being 100%. There you go. Seems like uh, seems like it's pretty pretty rock solid on that system then. Dude, just knowledge? No, yeah. Hopefully I remember that if for future reference for anyone else. Video Wizard, how are you? And thanks again. Thank you again for the resub. I'm thanking Paul for that's a lot of bits, man. Thank you so much. It all adds up. It really does. You never had PS3. The only time you wish you had one was now because you want to play Demon Souls. Demon Souls is really good. I like Demon Souls. It's one of the few PS3 games I own. There's always the option of emulation. I won't tell you how to do it or how to facilitate it because I enjoy streaming for a living and I don't want to jeopardize that. <laughs> Nor can anyone in chat put any, like, like emulation is fine, piracy isn't, right? Do we understand the difference? But I can tell you that emulation of PS3 works exceptionally well. <clears throat> I got a full 30 FPS trying it with zero issues and there are even patches to make it run at 60 which is wild it's absolutely wild to me i acquired a math book <clears throat> ps3 emulator got better now uses ps3 menu you see on console oh uh, yeah that sucks that it didn't work for you valandris when i tried it three years ago it was like i was shocked how flawless it ran I could not believe it. <laughs> I could not believe how well it ran. 
You finished your first run of Dark Souls 3 tonight, all bosses. You wanted more suffering before Elden comes out. Interesting. I, Dark Souls 3 is my favorite of the Soulsborne series. Within two hours, it was 70. That's what got you, man. It wasn't the cold weather. <clears throat> Temperature changes will get you more than anything. Flag bearers don't stack, says AY. That I did not know. <clears throat> that is good to know. Flag bearers do not stack. Met a waifu and lost a waifu. We did, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so Dina got kidnapped again. If anyone's curious, like, and they don't know what we're playing, there might be some lurkers out there that are like, what is this game? It's called Thousand Arms. It's a PlayStation 1 JRPG dating sim. Yes, that is correct. <laughs> It is weird. The the uh, the the premise of the game is that going on dates with women and garnering their affection empowers you to forge better swords. And on these dates, they frequently ask questions about farts. And one time, they asked me if I would eat Rocky Mountain oysters. Nothing about what I just said was made up. <laughs> legitimately what happens in this game <laughs> yeah i know it's sort of it's like oh my god farts it's like oh my god i'm so happy about farts <clears throat> i met the best waifu i i don't know what she does like she just stands in the back and why not continues to carry the team so it's a little weird i guess spell she can do heal and weaken. That's it. That's all she does. So, yeah, I don't really understand. The combat in this game is pretty bad, so. <laughs> do, 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 do. 85. Oof, that's really hot for me, video wizard. Sounds like a precursor to Boyfriend Dungeon. I watched Coco Confession play some of that. And she spent like the first two hours just being embarrassed to all to hell. <laughs> like she was not ready for that game, but the gameplay of that game, Boyfriend Dungeon, the actual gameplay of it looked super fun. <laughs> I was really impressed by it. I wonder what temperature it was in Chicago today. Let's see. Let's see everybody. What's the tip with you? Currently, it is a, uh, a, um, a temperate 15 Fahrenheit or minus nine Celsius. We apparently hit a high of 26 today. So, yeah. Typical Chicago weather in the winter, I tell you. <clears throat> da, 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 da. It is, you wouldn't think it was going to suck and you know, it's all after 20 minutes. You binge the entire thing in a day. That good, huh? That's pretty sick. That's pretty sick. It's not Thousand Arms, yeah. Yeah, Viserly, you'll have to let us know what you think of it if you play it. I know you like quirky games like that. Yo, Letty, what's up? How are you? Seventeen C. That's toasty. Rec Acquired the X of an antidote. Okay. Hades is very good. I don't even really like roguelites that much. But there are a few that really resonate with me. And that's one of them. And also... Coyote. Coyote. Is your name Coyote? Like the animal? Did I finally figure out how to say your name? Or coyote? Is it coyote? It's coyote. <laughs> it's coyote, isn't it? You've been here four months. <laughs> uh, I've been calling you like coyote. <laughs> 
<laughs> I finally fucking figured it out. <laughs> The shoe, yeah, the shoe is on the other foot now because that's what I do to everyone. When I go to a new channel and I just put my little phenomenon emote, you know, the popcorn emote, I put that in chat and I just wait and see the streamer try to figure out how to say my name. <laughs> the best part is everyone gets it wrong. <laughs> they all do, like without fail. It's a rare occurrence when someone gets it right. It's Coyote. <laughs> Yo, thanks for four months using that prime prime gaming sub. That's what we call as I adopted from old man Sethis. Uh he's a good streamer, by the way. Go check him out. I adopted from him, we call it the FU Jeff Bezos money because Amazon pays that sub. <laughs> uh it's, you know, it's appropriate. I, I think it works. <laughs> What's the most common butchering I hear? When they forget a few letters and they just say Finemon. That's the most common one I hear. Finemon. Like there's like a few letters missing there when they say it. Old man said this. Yeah, he's a good he's a good dude is entertaining as hell. He get he that dude brings energy to a stream. I don't know how he does it. Like just strains strains and yells and <laughs> He gets lewd as hell. It's pretty funny. <clears throat> but I hear that one too, Axumillion. Yeah, Finemon, I hear it too. Finemon is the most common one I hear. Yeah. Yeah, people think it's like Pokemon or Digimon. I'm like, you're missing a few letters. <laughs> it's too funny though. You know, people just mess it up all the time. <laughs> Yours is easy to say, but it's funny when someone is like, I keep reading your name wrong. That's the joke. Yeah. Brain dead, right? Brain dead. <laughs> yeah. I can't say Jeff, like Jeff's name there. Mine, on my end, it just says Jeff because I always get his name wrong. It's like, it's either Archius or Arceus, and no matter how many times he's told me what it is, I forget. I think he's told me like six times how to say it. I can't remember. Hold on, I interrupted your, your little tier three sound. This is a tier three. If you've been tier three sub, you get your own, uh, your own custom sound. No one could hear it. My name is Jeff. <laughs> yeah, there you go. He's Jeff, see? You live a good bowl of Finnaman Toast Crunch? I, I do too, yeah. Without milk, just put it in a cup and eat it. Like finger food. It's a good snack, yeah. Phenomenonicon? The Eldritch Book of Retro. Can I read it? What happens if I read it? What happens if I read it? It's an awesome idea for a coffee table book. <laughs> uh, the Archius is silent and the E is pronounced Jeff. See? Yeah, I always forget that part. So you summon Retro Thulu. Nice. Nice. The reason he's unknowable is because he's made of uh, interpolated pixels. So when you look at him, all you see is a blur. <laughs> There you go. See, that checks out. It makes sense to me. Someone has to blow on you to get you started? Oh my goodness. Common Rider Paul used stream loots. He got lucky enough to pull a legendary card from these packs, which makes me draw the current game protagonist in MS Paint. <laughs> I cannot draw, just so you know. I cannot draw. So this is gonna be interesting. Yep. Yep, so here we go. Black it out. And then we'll make it white. There. Jumpstart the art community for his community. <laughs> Don't King Shame Ashen with his barrels. He really loves those barrels, yeah. He really does. The random bag of cat treats. Oh, don't worry. It's not random, I promise you. It's a nightly thing here. It is a nightly thing here. I'm actually surprised Mog hasn't shown up yet. He's usually here for that. Okay, uh, mice. Let's see. What does he look like? Let me just 
remove the temptation in the game so I can't see him. <sighs> okay, so we'll give him the the kind of the douchey anime spiky hair. I think he has spiky hair. And I think he has a headband, if I'm not mistaken. Right? I think he has a headband, maybe. And then he makes these eyes a lot. He makes these eyes a lot whenever he sees a woman because he's a like womanizer. Uh, I don't know how you do this. Like, like huge pupils. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Uh, oh my god, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know how to draw. We'll give him a little uwu face, okay? <laughs> I don't think he has a mouth, I'm not sure, so we're just gonna give him one. Uh, and then he has an oversized sword. So, there's the hilt. There's the hilt. I think it might be curved, but I don't know. That, that looks suspicious. That looks suspicious as all hell. We're gonna put little, like, finger threads on it. So it looks like a finger. It actually looks like a finger and a fingernail. <laughs> uh, I don't remember what he's wearing. So it's red, but that's it. I can't tell what he's wearing. Mm, it's elk. Elk from Ark the Lad 2. I've never played those. Uh, and then he has a hammer too. So his smithing hammer. He has a smithing hammer, which is like massive, and he just like wears it on his back. And I don't know if it was at the end of the smithing hammer, there was something. So just for fun, we're gonna put uh uh Mog. See Mog's here and he's stepping on the mouse. Freaking Mog. Cute cat. We're gonna put a parakeet on the end of his hammer. So yeah, there you go. He's got a parakeet on the other end. Um and since he's anime, he has to make this, this hand gesture. He has to make this hand gesture. There you go. All right. This is anime, right? Is a pair of Keith's? Sure. Yeah, exactly. Here's his legs. Okay. Uh, and his other arm, we'll just say it doesn't exist. Okay, good. There you go. That's the main character from the game we're playing right now. Pretty good, right? Pretty good. Let's say we outdid ourselves this time. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Oh, that was terrible. It was so bad. Uh, okay. Don't do that. Don't do that. Save as I have to save it. I have to save it. Uh, let me put it in here. Where is it? Where is it? There. Save it as mice. Okay. E Why did it? I'm getting errors now. Come on. Come on. Come on. There. Sure. Okay, cool. We did it. We did it. I mean, other than the problem. Yeah, you said it. You said it, man. You said it, man. I think it was better than boop. you last one. Boop, 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 boop. I think it was better than you last one. Thank you. Thank you. That's good. We put that on the fridge so that Rumi can see it and then get it printed and framed. Wow. <laughs> uh, look, everyone. Look who it is. The little scamp is here. Hello, little scamp. Who's this scruffy guy? You're not very scruffy, actually. You got a nice coat, Mog. He is a scamp, though. He's absolutely a scamp. He is a real troublemaker. Have you seen my hands lately? He's been playful. Look at this. He's been playful. Look at my hand. <laughs> He's been wanting to play every night, every night, right? That's what you want. He says, "No more, no touch." Your voice is changing. 
No it's touch. A wizard did it. He said, no touch. DJ Mog. We will get to that. We're gonna do we're gonna give him treats first. I hope that's cool. Everybody likes cat treats. We're gonna do treats and then we'll do that. Blameful kitties, destructive little bastards. Yep. Yep, yep. Does that sound good, Ryu Olsen? We do treats and then the card. The card. Boop doo boop boop. Boo -do, do do do. Oh, I did have the name right. It is Ryu Olsen. Yeah. See? Look at him. He's just sitting there waiting. The expectant nature of a cat. I'm a boop your snoop. I booped your snoop, Moggy. Every cat owner knows the hand pains. Yeah. Yeah, you can't declaw them. That's like cutting their first knuckles off. That's not good for them. So you just deal with it. Treats, then he messes with the mixer. Exactly. Yeah. We've, we've seen that happen, haven't we? <laughs> Do you want some treats, little man? Yeah? Yeah? You want some treats? There you go. All right. Training. Training. Pets. Chin scratchies. Look at him resist. Treat. <clears throat> Pets. Chin scritchies. Don't you resist. Yeah. Treat. <laughs> He's like pushing against me. He's pushing against me. Wow, is that true, Valandries? That's that's hilarious. That's hilarious. Pets. Chin scratches. Look at him resist. Treat. Come on, Lickety. Come on. Come get your treats. Come over here. Come on. She's just staring at me. She needs to get her butt up here if she wants them. I don't think you can see her. No, you can't. Come on. Jump on the chair. Come on. All right. The diva, she's on the floor right there just staring at me. But she needs to get her butt up here. She won't get any. <clears throat> Come on. Come on. Good kitty. Good kitty. Come on. Yeah. Here she comes. <laughs> we coaxed her. What's up, Waldef? How are you? <clears throat> do, 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 do. There you go. There's another one. Get some pet pets. And your last one. There you go. All right. And that's all they get unless somebody gets lucky enough to pull the legendary stream loots card. There you go. Do you feel better now? You got your treat? Yeah. You feel better? She feels better. She's here to steal the show, everybody. It's what she does. It's what she does. See? <laughs> uh, look at this. She knows exactly where to go. She's too smart. <laughs> You're like, she's like blocking the camera and partially blocking chat. So I have to keep like craning over to see what everyone's saying. What are you doing, little lady? She got her use out of us, chat. <laughs> she got her use out of us. Okay. All right. I'm going to pet the cat. Yeah. Mog would like that. Lickety would be terrified. She's terrified of strangers. Mog loves strangers. He turns into a different cat whenever he meets someone new. And then when he gets comfortable, then it's playtime when he goes bitey boy. <laughs> oh. 
Well, Mog messed up the mixer again. Here we go. All right, everybody. Mog stepped on the mixer. This is just, this is our life now. We, we, we live here. We sound like this. It's good, right? It's what you all wanted. Darkens wants to pet the cat with his hands. How sinister. You sound so much better that way. Well, Mog is the audio engineer of the stream, so, you know, he's had a lot of practice taking naps on the 16 channel mixer. Yes, he's actually done that. Yep. Mm hmm mm hmm mm hmm mm hmm He's done that. He, d he did that. Multiple times. Had to teach him to stop doing that. That was uncomfortable. This sounds fun. What's that? Cayman Rider Paul enjoys a good <clears throat> blind playthrough. Blind? The monitor is off. Chat. The monitor is off. Mario Where Galaxy do I has go? Nothing on this. <clears throat> what do I do? I can't see. Alright, chat. I can't play. I can't see the game anymore. This is up to you. It's up to you, chat. It's a me, uh, Ouija. It's up to you. Need to go up. There we go. Going up. I think we zoned. I think we zoned. I think it worked. Oh, well, okay. The mixer. The mixer seems to have malfunctioned. Mog's adjustments no longer are in effect. <laughs> Left. Okay. Uh. It's upside down, so it's actually my right. So here we go. Left. I can't move anymore. That doesn't do anything. A bit up. Yes, I got something. I don't know what it is, but I heard something open. <laughs> what did we get? What did we find? <clears throat> Classy shoes. Ooh, I don't know if that's a gift or it might be a gift for a lady or an accessory. <clears throat> Classy shoes. Nice. Nicely done. Nicely done. Uh, oh shit. I didn't mean to do that. Alright, I'm assuming I go back where I came from. So... Now I need to go right. <laughs> A little up. Okay, stop going up. <laughs> um... Okay, I'm not in a cutscene. <clears throat> One more instruction. You're in a room with a guy. In a chest. Well, that could be bad. Left. Up left. Okay. Monitor on. Alright. Woo! 
That was weird. We got an item though. I'm in a room with a chest I already got. Okay, so you guys wanted me to go in this door. Okay. Wait, but you said I was in a room with a chest and a guy. Oh. Oh, I must have left the room. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> Acquired revive. Ooh. Wow, visitor, I'm middle. One of the Benley brothers. Okay. I'll heal you now. I hope you appreciate it. Oh. We went the right way. I went back out when I went left too far. Oh, okay. Okay. Spear. Are they called Spear Germans? Oh, Gear Man. Not German. Spear Gear Man. Ow. You missed, lady. Ow! Dun, dun, dun. The beds feel a little too Squid Games. What is Squid Games? I've heard of it quite a bit lately, but I don't know what it is. Gear Man, an unused Mega Man boss. Nice. That was fun. Yeah, I figured during those uh, monitor off segments, chat gets literally like the full backseat instructions. One of the rare times you can do that. Ooh. Ooh, that, okay. Those could, those could add up. From Germany, Achtung, Achtung. I don't know how to say that. Why, sorry. <laughs> uh, I'm bad with the German syntax and pronunciations. There we go. There we go. Ball, ball, ball. Korean live action show where poor people play death games for my Oh right, I did hear that. I people that know me told me I would hate that show, so I haven't watched it. They said I would not like it at all. Critical of capitalism I having extremely in debt people play death games. Wow. I was told that it would frustrate me for other reasons. I don't remember exactly what they said about it that I wouldn't like. There was some kind of specific like design element in the show that people said that would just drive me nuts. Like, and I wouldn't enjoy it. Like it was it like or cringy or like no resolution or I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to like any details because I've not seen it and I don't want people to be spoiled if they want to watch it. But yeah, I would it was, I was told that I would personally not like it. Enter the blocky dream world of 8-bit pixels. Okay, Rio Olsen, you got it. Rio Olsen has played the pixelized card. Oops. There you go. There's a little indicator in this. <laughs> I didn't know this had that. Look. I didn't know this game had that. <laughs> uh, you thought I was good. I'm going to trust the people that told me I wouldn't like it and not watch it, but I don't watch a lot of shows. So that's really what it boils down to. Stream is ready. Thank you. Yeah, let's do that for me. You broke down most of your cards. Yeah, I like that you have that option. I didn't want people to feel like they got cards that were just worthless to them and then they were stuck with them. I like that you can break them down and accumulate enough to make other cards. I think that's pretty cool. That's why I actually made specific cards for that purpose. I have cards on there that you aren't supposed to be played that give you a bunch of craft points. They're basically craft material cards so that you can make ones that you want. The confirm button is disabled a bit so you can't progress and need to take a short break. We have a forced break card. It's a legendary card. Um, we already have that one, so. 
That's I'm assuming that's basically what you're getting at. But yeah, we have one of those. It's basically like if we could pull that card, we'll watch like a few retro commercials. Or if it's like time to take a break, then yeah, we'll just do the full thing right then and there. That card has only been played once. And I it was my first night and I hadn't fully learned how the system works yet. So I ended up giving the card back because I had already taken a break and I didn't really know how I wanted to do it yet, but someone had a good idea like, hey, oh, let's just take a few minutes and watch a couple commercials. And that's way better because normally my intermissions are pretty long, you know, like I eat dinner and we watch silly commercials together while I'm still here on the mic. So we're still engaging with each other. So yeah, that one works. Flip camera like a mirror. Uh, that basically would just be like the upside down one, but instead I'd be looking the wrong way. That one would, is one of my pet peeves, and I would say no to that. One of my pet peeves on Twitch is when you watch a channel and someone on camera is facing away from the game. That's a pet peeve of mine, so I don't want that as a card. Because <laughs> it's just going to make me upset and uncomfortable. Do, 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 do. Takes a quick break is good, though. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you don't want it cards to shut your stream down, but like a few minutes, like five minutes, you know, that I can do. That's no problem. And I think I have that one set to only be once per once per stream. Like it's like it can only be used like once a day or something like that. Yeah, you got a Becky darkens. Yeah, Becky plays for 10 minutes. Folks like that one that, that, that I think that's been the most popular one of the legendaries we've gotten so far. The game becomes upside down on screen. So all that would do is affect you. I don't play on an emulator. I'm playing on a PS1 on a CRT monitor. I can't do that. So it would only affect what you see. And I don't really see the point. <laughs> I don't really see the point. So, you know, it would just make it harder for you to watch the show and nothing else. Legendary do a wheel spin. Wheel spin? That's an idea. All right, I'll put that in the consideration. Wheel spin for loots. Like a legendary? Legendary wheel spin. That's probably the right rarity for it too, Paul, I would say, if we did that. Okay, cool. Cool idea. And one Stern Feely has purchased five chests. Wow! <laughs> Mr. McFeely, thank you so much. That's awesome. Remember CRTs that have pivots? I mean, mine has options, but I don't think it lets me do horizontal or vertical flips. And I wouldn't really want to mess with it that way. It's set just right. Because it is analog. It's an old, it's a 20 year old monitor. Sing a song about how I feel about the game. I can't do it. I have a super anxiety thing about songs. Sorry. I, I, I made that an incentive one years ago and I just froze. I won't do it. I refuse. Do, 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 do. Flip the CRT and get swole. <laughs> yeah, just turn it upside down. Sure. Uh, oh, man. I appreciate that, Lundea. Flipping outputs on CRT is super hard. Don't do it. Yeah, I, I, I wouldn't do it. Writing a haiku. Uh, I'll put it in the suggestion box. I've never tried that. Writing a haiku for loots. So these are all in the suggestion box to be considered. Jeff, thanks for hanging out, man. I appreciate it. It was good to have you. People ask you to do voices sometimes because you do well in improv. Right. If you free, force me to freeze up, I had to do a weird accent card. And as some of you saw, I had to get rid of it because I was having the same issue. Like if it's on demand, it doesn't work. I just can't do it on demand. Like it's, it just has to be in the moment or it just does not happen. Come on, save Damashi. Yes, I want to save. Yay. You have to have a capture card running and send the signal back out to CRT. It's not optimal if you're not using a super NT. No, I use original hardware only. So super NTs and like analogs and things are really cool, but I'm playing this on a PS1, for example. Can we get Zapara haikus? I don't know how you would program a bot to do that. 
I have no idea how you would even begin to do something like that. I mean, if that's possible, ask Zyfreak, but I don't really understand how any of that shit works, to be honest. So, <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> Bippy, one of my mods suggested that last night. That's actually going to happen. <laughs> it's just going to be like the other cosplays, but just the mustache. So, yeah, that's actually going to happen. So that's a good idea. We're actually doing that one. What the hell are you doing here? Stupid humans aren't permitted here. Ban Zapara for 30 minutes. Nah, I gotta have to say no to that. Zapara is a stream feature. <laughs> well, I gotta say no. Use me, princess. I gotta cosplay as Link. All right. All right, who played that? Let's see. That was, oh, Mr. McFeely. There you go. Do you like my expert cosplay? It's good, right? It's good. It's good. Is it supposed to be a cutscene? Yeah, the art direction in this game is really good. Stupid. Best cosplay ever. You're the stupid one. You really think you can make people follow you through tyranny? So I didn't get to you in time, McFeely, but maybe you already knew. But since we've been doing so well with stream loots, they gave us discount codes for people to use. And these work on your next purchase one time only. So if you folks want to get some packs, you can use those discount codes right there. And they take the cut. You get the discount. I get the full amount for my split. They take the cut. So if you folks want to, you know, if you are interested in trying out stream loots and getting packs, you can use those once each time i believe each code you can use once humans have willpower which you machines lack machines can never rule humans <laughs> cycle <clears throat> you're innocent that wasn't wasn't anonymous that's that says your name <laughs> uh. Pathetic humans, you don't understand anything. Machines are perfect. <laughs> you like my floating hat? We are destined to rule. Worthless humans, I will destroy all of you. If you folks like the stream rate loots and you want to try it out yourself, um, they like how well we've been doing with it and they gave us discount codes. And both of those work one time only per person. So if you're interested, take a look. Um, it's been it's been doing really well for us. You know, it's, it's just another way to help keep the lights on for me to improve the channel and the community. Um, your support, like on Patreon, for example, is reasons why I can pay DMs to run D&D one shots for our community there in Discord. So I don't just sit here and watch the numbers go up when you folks help me out i put it back like i invest i make things better for all of us and myself so i'm almost to the next level in stream loot really already wow it still says 40 it hasn't maybe i have to refresh Yeah, it just says 40 to me. Oh, now it says 30. Oh, yeah, it did go up. Wow. That's wild. Yeah, if we get to the next tier in stream loots, um, we get another discount code that everyone gets to use. It, they just keep throwing them at us. It's pretty cool. And we got a ways to get to that, though, but... <clears throat> We're getting there. <laughs> it actually tells me exactly how much you need to do it. It's kind of wild. <clears throat> Where's the helmets? Menisk, are you mocking this bearing guy? Stream loots is fun. Yeah, I'm, I'm a big fan. Because it's a lot like the bot system that I had, right? For our marathons, like the Zelda marathons. It's very similar to that. It's just more visual. And I think people will attach to that better. Plus the, like the whole website. You know, the website UI for it is super helpful. Dun, 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 dun. All right. 
boss fight. Let's go. I clearly should have healed beforehand, but you know, this is our life. And 84. That's pretty good while he was defending. All right, we need this heal. Malsha, you are nowhere near as good a healer <laughs> as, as, uh, what's her name? Sadina? Sadina? Yeah, nowhere near as good. That's okay. My guts. Let's boost her attack. All right, I got another question for everyone. Another question. Let's pose this one to chat while we do this boss fight. Do you need blind Nelsha? It won't let me do anything with her in the back except sit there or um, cast a, like two spells. That's why I don't like the gameplay in this. The folks in your back row are like extremely restricted in what they can do. 98, okay. 329, wow. She reminds you of Velma from Scooby-Doo. She does kind of look like Velma, doesn't she? <clears throat> oh yeah, for a question I wanted to pose to everyone. Um, if cost didn't matter, right? So let's just assume you have the capability of doing this. If cost didn't matter, what hobby would you do? All right, let's have Mice do a heal and see if he's better. doing special so I'm gonna defend you learn more instruments that is a costly hobby yeah, I could see that 98 nice cancel the action no don't Somebody stop me. <laughs> traveling so you'd go like travel the world j-rock Do Desmo, you say you would have all the D&D minis from all the editions that had them. Ooh, cool. I like that one, too. Karma, you would buy a tank. That's a hobby? Just buying a tank is a hobby? Okay, fair enough. You know, I'm not going <laughs> to... I'm not going to yuck your yum. I'm struggling to see where the hobby part of that is, but all right. <laughs> Uh, you'd find a school for art to join. Oh, cool, cool. One day you'd learn to draw. For years you thought you were a shit student. It turns out ADHD makes learning hard when there's not structure. Yes, it does. Yeah, it absolutely does. I said you get a lot of Lego sets. Ooh, nice. I'd probably do that too. Filmmaking, Bilimus? Sick. Why is he'd raise horses? I know a streamer that is amassing a fortune on Twitch for that very reason. <laughs> She's rather infamous, but easily the hardest working person on Twitch. <laughs> uh, Mr. McFeely, you would travel to all 50 states just so you can say you've po pooped in all 50 states. <laughs> I kind of like that. That one's out of the box right there. <laughs> I have pooped in 50 states. Next, the underlying territories of Puerto Rico and Guam. <laughs> Uh, you like the idea of woodworking or furniture creation, but let's be real. You probably just have more board games. Board games is a cool hobby. I know a lot of people do that. Paul, you go to space. What would you do in space, Paul? What would you do in space? Going to space, like just travel, just a different kind of travel. That's kind of cool. Anyway, you would collect military tanks and do like drive tanks and set up a field where people could drive and fire them. Oh, that. Okay. I could see that. Yeah, Cucumber, yeah. Among many other things, yeah. Yeah, I'm talking about Amaranth. She is the hardest working person on the platform. It's just, it's just unquestionable. All it takes is one search on an analytic platform to see it. <laughs> it's it's just mind-blowing. Be decking out your room even more in video games and recover your lost library. That was a hobby for me that became a, a, a kind of a profession, didn't it? 
It was a hobby for me initially, and it became part of the profession. You're trying to get a race team going. Talking with a few wealthy folks to try to get funding. Your hobby is race cars, and you do race cars well. Nice. That's pretty cool. It sounds... I like that you're uh, trying to further that. It's hard to do. With Cyril, you'd either already have a hurdy-gurdy, or you'd get yourself a fully furnished lab with materials to experiment and various transhumanism things like... Feet, fully featured human like limbs or organs you mean like for like limb replacement or like organ replacement or you get yourself a forge and forge weapons right on right on x2 i love it your philosophy on furniture is why spend a hundred dollars on a table when you could spend three hundred dollars on tools to make a table <laughs> well if you make four tables then they've paid for themselves, right? <clears throat> Darkens wants to poop around the world. Ravenin, you'd collect every anime figure and video game. And spend your life traveling. Nice, nice. Mm. Oh, did I miss Weiss's? Oh, race horses. Right, 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 right. You would love to have a hurdy gurdy as well, Desmo. They they do sound pretty cool, don't they? They do sound pretty cool. Damage 76, not bad. I didn't see how much healing mice did, so. Oh. How do we cancel her action? Yes, frontline. There we go. Cars are expensive. You're already 40k deep in your current race motor. Do you do like, do you get to enter like around you or do you know places where you can like do races for cash prizes or anything like that? You sometimes watch YouTube's videos of people making river tables with wood and resin and they always turn out so good. Are those the ones that like the top of the table looks like, like a resin sealed like diorama? Is that what you're talking about? Like it looks like the, there's like a like a like a riverbed or a riverbank in them. I've seen people do that before, like stuff like that, where they seal it in resin. Those are the tables. Yeah, that's pretty cool stuff. <clears throat> Bill, when you think you didn't mention this yesterday, you had your first mini session for Superhero Savage Royal Campaign. Oh, that's cool, man. Comet is swingy. Ooh, that sounds that sounds scary. That sounds scary. Dame Brad, that's why you say woodworking or furniture, because you don't need a lot of space, but you do need a lot of organizing. Yeah, I honestly want like a bunch of shelves I can put on the walls for the cats to run around. That would be pretty sweet. I would like that. If money were no issue, you would hire people to make game ideas you have. You already do this, but you're so bad at coding, you can hear coders screech in unison every time you're trying to code something. <laughs> I might do the same, Unimasa. Yeah. I'm definitely an ideas kind of guy. <clears throat> You'd pay to have a higher speed raceway than the Nuremberg ring made and collect and test supercars on it. But it'll be formula style raceway, not a NASCAR ring. Nuremberg, that's like the, the famous test track people go to test like top speeds of cars, right? I think I saw that on Top Gear a few times. Crit rate increase. Fuck yeah, get him! As she crits for 815, the highest damage we've ever done. Okay. <laughs> yes. Do that again, why not? Do it again. 
let's see what do we got we got 90 units on the stream raiders boss battle 10 minutes left let's see how many we can get <clears throat> those are the tables yeah those sound cool man you know someone who makes those and his sister always reposts he wants like three to five hundred dollars for them i think it's because resin itself is really expensive that's probably the most costly part of the table is the resin You get a few local tracks for drag and GT, but none are offering enough cash to make it work. Current car is being built for YouTube and race week events. Uh, don't just don't uh, discount TikTok either for discoverability. Like if you're trying to get eyes on what you do, make if you, you can especially do short form content, especially if you're doing drag, because those are all those races are only a few seconds, right? That's kind of built for TikTok, because that's all short form content you know 60 second videos or less or three minutes or less depending on your account i wouldn't discount that it's the current highest speed test track in the world nuremberg okay it looks like ads are running so i'm gonna wait i'm just gonna pause gameplay here i'm just gonna pause gameplay while i read chat like i like i wasn't doing that already right Uh, there you go. <laughs> First two rounds of combat run event, full round three of one of your guys. Some capacity from hits they took. Round four flipped back. Wow. Top gear had their own race racetrack. Yeah, I remember the uh what was that guy's name? The Stig, right? The Stig or whatever? And the guy at the the with the unknown identity, it was like a running joke. And then they would have guests race on the track. I always liked when they had the guests race on the track. I always thought that was really cool. The ratings dropped as they let Jeremy go. Which one was Jeremy? What are we talking? Are we talking about the same top gear? I'm confused. <laughs> what game is this, Desmo? Here, let me show you. This is called Thousand Arms on the PS1. It is a JRPG dating sim. No joke. Um, honestly, incredibly good art design, really good music, basic story. Gameplay is not good. Uh, it's super quirky and funny though. So it's been an overall positive experience. We've had a good time with it. <clears throat> You'd hire people to build a real life working enterprise. I would argue that there's probably not enough money or resources in the world to do that. <laughs> we would need to be able to know, like we would need the infrastructure and technology to harvest asteroids to do something like that. Just from the metal alone. We've been in a chip shortage for years. So like money isn't gonna make more chips. We would need to look outside the planet <laughs> to do something like that <clears throat> that would literally you would literally have to change society fundamentally to pull that off <clears throat> Nuremberg is for how well a car handles it's a complex track pure top speed is the VW test loop Bonneville salt flats I know about the salt flats or the Le Mans. I've heard of the Le Mans. <clears throat> You're gonna leverage TikTok in a big way? Yeah, good luck. I hope it works. One of your friends after his house burned down recreated his collection of games and this was one of his rarest ones. Well, I'm sorry to hear that that happened, but it's good he's able to start building it back up. I did not... Actually, wait a minute. One sec. <clears throat> I might have that. Cat, are you here? I don't know if Cat's here still. It's pretty late. She's usually not here this late, I don't think. Salt flats are cool in person. I've never been. I would like to see them. 
<clears throat> it's been five years since he rebuilt it and made it better. That's good. That's good. That's perseverance right there. Yeah, I don't think catastrophe is still here. Let me check something really quick. Are you talking about this? Is this what you mean? <clears throat> this thing? Cause I got, I got both. This was recent. These were both gifts, separate people. I don't know like what this worth. Like I have never, no intent of ever selling it. Like it's for me to have and enjoy and for us, you know, you never seen sent in for it. Gotcha. Oh, you had to actually specially send in for this. Wow. This is rare then, isn't it? Soundtrack and multimedia CD. The cast soundtrack, a screensaver, a desktop theme, four cool wall wallpapers, links to hot gaming websites. Look at that. <clears throat> Check the manual. What do you mean? Oh, in the game? Was that like a thing you had to do? Like you had to send in for it? <clears throat> There's a send in form cardboard. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> so there was. <clears throat> Your friend said it was comedically bad. So bad. It's good kind this game. Yeah, it definitely hits that. This is like, yeah, like I have totally complete in box. It even came with this, this cool thing. Isn't that neat? Little hologram card of mice. I think that's pretty cool. <clears throat> this does not fit in there though. It's not designed to, but yeah. Do. Oh, there we go. Make sure that's nice and snug. What is this disc? It says soundtrack and multimedia CD. <clears throat> yeah, I usually pop them up Mooney Masa when we're looking at stuff like that so I can see it more clear. You need to see if he managed to get that. I don't imagine that if you had to send in for it, I imagine they were there are not too many of them out there. You don't know if he has the card. Oh, okay. Gotcha. <clears throat> gotcha. 420. <laughs> That's the sex number. <laughs> 90. Okay. 345. Just keep attacking. Uh, you are going to heal her. <clears throat> oh, you do weekend? No, do that. Yeah, do weekend. Ooh, nice crit. Are right, we going to defend? <clears throat> Ready for your I got, I have to tell you folks, uh, I haven't said anything yet because It's not a hundred percent yet. It's not a hundred percent yet. However, oh my God. Okay. Uh, manage to snag an auction of Ogre Battle on the Super Nintendo. And when it gets here, I will open it up to ensure authenticity and test if it saves. 
but it looks like it's finally happening. <laughs> yeah, Desmo, it was nice having you. Yeah, thanks for hanging out with us. Look forward to seeing you again. So I have a copy of Ogre Battle on the way. Hopefully it's not a reproduction cart again. I don't think it will be this time. Hopefully not. Hopefully not. We'll see what happens, right? No, Ogre Battle, not Ogre Battle 64. The actual original Super Nintendo game, which is like one of my favorite Super Nintendo games. 144 units. You folks, <laughs> you folks are bringing it. <clears throat> There you go. 540, nice heal. Deliberations. I thought you were just saying some kind of like slang version of that word and I was trying to pronounce it. Now I understand. You will die. That is a seriously strong AOE attack. wildly strong like Nelsha is losing like more than half her life when he does that du, 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 du. book of delay use it use it we need to <laughs> Defend Nelsha heal. Apparently not Nelsha. It's mice. Spell. Heal Nelsha. Hopefully she doesn't die. <laughs> uh, Autocorrect doing you no favors. This is all, all good. I have. I want to play those MGS games. They're on the next list. There's like one entry, one through three. Please don't. Uh oh, what's this? Okay, he's only hitting her. Perfect. That's exactly what we needed. Uh, what happened? I don't know. He's doing special. Oh, okay. I think he canceled my action or something. Okay. Heal plus on yourself. We're just like mitigating a lot here, but we aren't doing, he's almost dead. We just need to get a good hit on him when he's not like spamming special attacks. Ready for your Attack, okay, this is her turn. Here we go. What am I saying, Talia? How you doing? I appreciate the non-spoiler there. I would love to play those games someday. I don't know when it'll happen, but I would. Did that attack miss? I don't think so. I just think it did very small damage. I would like to be able to stream it for you folks. MGS one through three are definitely retro to me, so. Oh, what a kill. <laughs> 815 with a crit. Tired was a hard and long day, but ended up being a good day. Nice to hear, man. That's good stuff. Yo, uh, to you, Seamus, and others, if you didn't know, your continued support on Patreon is why I've been able to hire a second DM to run a one-shot for us in Discord. Um, Simply Jackson's going to run one for us it's around the beginning of next month. So if you're interested in trying out D&D 5th &D, uh, Edition, even if you're brand new, uh, our DMs will help you out. They'll help you walk through the process. So make sure you join that Discord and send me a DM if you're interested. And we'll get you that role, okay? Because we want, we want everybody to have the chance to play D&D who wants to. And I really encourage you to do so. Hey, thanks. Thanks, Darkens, for the GGs and Rat Burger. Real awesome. Take care, brother. It was good to have you, man. Thanks for uh, having fun with the stream loots, too. I'm glad that it was fun for you. <clears throat> Do 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 do. <laughs> GG. GG. Thanks. Thank you, Linda. 
and Shyness. Item revive extra. Okay. Listen, folks, this is not a dinner party. We've been over this. All right. When one person leaves, you don't all need to leave at the same time. There must be some kind of mistake. <laughs> Cut it up. I can't believe I lost to a miserable showman. Uh. <sighs> Wow, that was a death scene. That was a death scene. Bum, 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 Mice, your hammer. Get it, mice. Boom. Looks cool. Power of wind is upon you. I am Rao, the elemental beast of the wind. Very funny, Dane Brad. <laughs> Suspiciously colored leakage. Oh, man. Getting up to the wife's sisig. What is that? Season and finely chopped pork with onions and jalapenos over rice. Ooh, that sounds really good. We gotta save Sedina, dude. Yeah, let's do it. Where are we supposed to go? Most likely, Sedina was taken to Dianova. Want to try the computer? Maybe we can find Dianova with it. Sure. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba. 25 o'clock. Dark Master returns to Dianova with Sedina as prisoner. System log. There you go. Uh. Oh. So Diana must be going through hell. We have to get Sedina back and smash Bad Emperor. Yeah! We will rescue Sedina. Ship will take us to Dianova. Okay. All right, let's do it. Yeah. It's ridiculously good. It sounds really good. I wonder what kind of seasoning it has. They had the internet. Yeah, apparently. <laughs> and internet access on this thing. Ooh, cutscenes. Cool, we'll man. Arrive at Dianova in two minutes. Please be seated and prepared. I wonder how they land this we'll thing. We'll arrive at Dianova huh? in two minutes. Please be seated and prepared for landing. I wonder how they land this thing. Oh my god. <laughs> We're crashing. <laughs> we missed. Oh no, we lost control. No! What are we gonna do, mice? Ah! Or we didn't crash? I thought we did. This is gonna hurt. Let's cram up. Wow. Well, that's one way to open the front door. We're so heroic. Now this is pot race. Oh my God. Mog came over to mope because my roommate turned the fan on. What are we going to do? Um, you know, leaders are usually located at the top of a castle. Yes. Let's head for the top floor. Sure. Save Damashi. Thank God. <laughs> what is uh, Samurai 7, Darkens? What is that? I liked everyone's answers, though. The whole, what would you do as a hobby if money was no issue? You all gave some really interesting answers. 
I would probably hire teams to make games and also buy a lot of Lego sets, which is like two answers two people separately gave, but they are my answers. <laughs> they are also my answers. Uh, it was a short anime series. Okay, fair. I've never heard of it. Keep it up. I will. I will keep up crashing and everything indiscriminately. You know, there's a door there. What about this, though? This leads somewhere. This is technically the world map. Weird. See, the seasoning soy sauce, garlic, pepper, bay leaves, and calamansi lime sauce. I've never heard of that. What is calamansi lime sauce? I wonder if this is a way to warp. I wonder if we can warp in and out of this place. I'm not sure. Du, 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 du. Uh, warp is not in there. Did you not teach us warp, lady? Okay, now I'm just confused. Oh, I see. It's right there. Dianova is on here. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. That means we can come back. How am I going to make more weapons with Sodina? I mean, I'll have to use the others. I'll have to use the others to forge, not because you use any of the ladies to do it. Yo, what's up, Master V? Good old dusting. I use the uh, dust shields of mine. These dust shields of mine. Okay, this was not an ideal place to go. Never mind. This is a maze. Okay. <laughs> Forget it. Uh, we'll go to a different place. I thought it was going to take me inside. It was literally a maze with enemies. The music is different here now. Um. What was the name of that flying town? Do you remember? I think it may be have, may have been destroyed. We dust their PC? Oh yeah, especially when I use both of them for a living. Be a good idea if you don't want things to magic smoke. Oh, the old blue smoke, yep. <laughs> the old blue smoke, pretty scary stuff. I don't think that place is there anymore. That happened to me in college before I really knew what I was doing. Yeah, Darkens. Yeah, I was thinking of that place. That's what I was thinking about. Trying to go in this place here. Go in the town. Why won't you go in the town? I'm so confused. Okay, we're going somewhere else. This is either glitched or we're not allowed to go there. Very strange. Let's go to a rock bit. PCs run on smoke. Once the smoke escapes, the PC doesn't work anymore. Right. So that reminds me, as I was saying, in college, on my like first PC, the real one that I owned, um, I bought parts for a second PC, right? This is a fucking mine. I can't just find a town to like sleep. I think I actually know where to go. So anyway, I it didn't come with a heat sink, okay? 
this the I bought like a CPU, motherboard, RAM, blah blah blah, right? Didn't come with a heatsink, and I was like, well, that's weird. So I took my old one off of it, off of the initial PC, put it on the new one, which fit perfectly. Um, but the thing wouldn't post, so I was like, huh, that's weird. So I was, like trying to diagnose that, and I was like, well, I need the internet to diagnose that. So I turn on the old PC, but what did I forget to do? Mog. He's attacking Becky again. What did I forget to do when I turned on the old PC? <laughs> when I plugged it back in, you know, turned on the old one. Who can guess what I had forgotten to do? <laughs> it won't be too hard to figure out. Dun dun Hey Marius, how are you? Let's go here. So okay, it doesn't look like anyone can guess. So I turned on the old one. I had forgotten to put the heat sink back on it. So I turn it on, fans are whirring up. I turn around to start kind of poking at the motherboard and I start hearing this weird high pitched whining noise, almost like somebody was like a teapot was going off. I'm like, what the fuck? And I turn around and this blue smoke is just shooting out of the processor. I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> so I immediately hit that power switch on the back that just cuts the power to the whole system. It's just like this weird hyper color blue smoke is just puffing out of the, the processors, which was a Cirrus 333 processor and i was like oh no so i had one pc that wouldn't post and then the old one which i just saw bright blue smoke come out of which i had never seen anything like in my life and i'm freaking the fuck out because <laughs> i'm like oh no i might not have any pcs now like just losing my mind yeah blue bright blue smoke comes out of the processor that's what master v's talking about when he said the magic smoke <laughs> He's not kidding. <laughs> when those things get too hot and you see blue smoke, there are problems. Some really bad problems. So I took the heat sink off the new parts because it wasn't posting anyway. Put it on the old Cyrix. I don't know why it's blue, but it, as far as I know, that still happens today. Uh, put it on the Cyrix, put everything back together, sweat in buckets, right? Turn the thing on and it was like nothing had ever happened. It worked perfectly until I eventually got that PC working. That processor never had a problem. It was like nothing happened. I don't know why it still worked. I have no idea, <laughs> but it worked as if nothing had happened. <laughs> but that's when I saw the, f the one and only time I had in person seen the magic smoke come out of a processor. It was terrifying. <laughs> Wake up, sleepyhead. I am, to this day, I have no idea why the thing still worked after that, but it did without any issue. Did I have thermal paste? There was no thermal paste on that thing. It was just a heat sink that looked like it just sat on this processor with like a rubber pad or something, or, or maybe it was graphite. I don't know. It was some kind of black pad that it just kind of sat on it. It was an old, old processor and an old heat sink. This was like in like 2001 or something like that. Blue smoke means it's burning oil or oil based stuff. Hmm. Back in the day, thermal paste was pretty rare. Yeah, that's what I figured. Like the first time I ever had to use that, my then roommate and this was like 07 06 he's like okay you gotta get put thermal paste on it and i'm like wait what does that mean i don't have anything like that i didn't know what the hell he was talking about i was like i don't have any thermal paste he's like it should have come with it i'm like no i didn't get anything like that so he had some thankfully but i didn't know what he was talking about and i just see him putting this gray goop on my cpu i'm like you gotta be kidding this isn't a joke you're putting gray goop on it he's like yeah <laughs> Look, all right. <laughs> Thermal pad. Okay, there you go, Vlad. Yeah, I didn't even like to this day. I didn't know what it was. It was just, it was just a fan that kind of sat on that little, I guess, thermal pad there. 
And um, 12. Jesus, that's terrible. It did its thing. But yeah, the blue smoke was absolutely terrifying. <laughs> I was not ready for that. I gotta tell you. I gotta tell you. Pitter patter. Little pitter patters. So that's the magic smoke. If you wanted to know, I've seen it in person and it'll scare the hell out of you. <laughs> uh, date a girl. <gasps> Chat. We finally get to date Nelsha. We finally get to date Nelsha. We finally get to date Nelsha. <laughs> Uh, are you ready? Are you ready for the weird? You never seen the magic smoke and had hardware survive? Yeah, I don't know why it still works. I just don't. So. All right, let's give Nelsha a present. Here. She seems like a big teddy bear kind of girl, doesn't she? So, here you go. I'm a teddy bear, Nelsha. I have a present for you. Nelsha wonder what it is. <laughs> She's so weird. Big teddy bear. This is wonderful. Thank you, mice. She liked it. That was a happy noise. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> she really liked it. <laughs> Woo. Okay, we're off to a good start. <laughs> All right. Well, we softened her up. All right. Now we're going to take her on the date. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Let's go, Nelsha. You wonder what kind of fart question she'll ask. God. What a game, huh? Okay. Let me get the poll system ready just in case. Just in case. Some questions. Chat gets to answer. Especially when I am like, I have no idea. I, l I let... We, we let the committee decide. We let the committee decide. <laughs> no, Tate Brett, don't do it. There we go. There we go. Do, 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 do. Now she want to eat till she's stuffed. I mean, that's relatable. Sometimes that's fun. What do you want to eat? You're going to get fat if you eat too much? We're not saying that. No. This is obvious. What do you want to eat? Nelsha wants candy right now. Is she like nine years old? She's not. We've seen her cosplay, but what the hell? <laughs> Bob Dole fruits of Nelsha. <laughs> what a dated reference. Same. Yeah, Luna's like same. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, B was terrible answer. Is there a cure for lovesickness? Is there a cure for lovesickness? There's no need. It's an important part of falling in love. I guess you can try to make one. A sounds like a pretty mature response. Right? This one's just like, I guess, if you want to try. This one seems dismissive as hell. I'm sure this will be the most normal conversation ever. All right. There's no need. It's an important part of falling in love. I'm just going to pick this one. Oh, you're so romantic, Mice. Her eyes did the anime glimmer thing. Oh, my God. <laughs> I guess that was a good answer. Guess what you're thinking. Okay. Well, now she guess what you're thinking. Ah, shit. <sighs> okay, this is one for chat. This is absolutely one for chat. You can type one or A, two or B. Either one counts. Either one counts. What do you got? I'm thinking about our future for A. I was thinking about dinner for B. She did say she wanted to get stuffed, but thinking about her future, 
to be honest, it seems like you're rushing, but this is Thousand Arms. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it is Thousand Arms. And it's just like, man, some of these answers are just so zany. Dun, 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 dun. You're staying far away from this. <laughs> It could be either one due to what she said in a short time. Right. You pick B because you started with food. Plausible deniability. <laughs> uh, all right. Do we have any more folks to mind about? Help us pick the answer. Do, 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 do. Type A or one in chat for I was thinking about our future. Type B or two in chat for I was thinking about the dinner. We're dating again, negative divide. Yep. This isn't letting her guess. I know, right, Ravenin? That's why the answers are so silly sometimes. Do -do -do -do. Nice and chill music. <laughs> All right. It looks like chat has decided we're going to say answer B. I was thinking about the dinner. 10 votes to four. Thanks for voting. Thanks for participating. Here we go. I was thinking about the dinner. Are you sure that's it? <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> oh, she didn't like that. Did you feel anything special when we first met? Did you feel anything special when we first met? I felt I'd met my soulmate. I thought you were gorgeous. Shit! This is all you again, chat. I'm gonna take a sip, like Paul said. <laughs> Hey, you can vote. <laughs> she did look defeated, didn't she, Moody Masa? Yeah. Extra romantic with some air biscuit. <laughs> oh, no. A dime's too deep, so Dana would slap you. But would Nelsha, right? We don't know. This is so weird. Oh. <sighs> Well, A is diving too deep. Reasonably. That's the reasonable answer, right? She gives you A vibes. Mm. Interesting point. See, I felt an air biscuit. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Wow, this is a pretty close vote here. It's a really close vote. Did anyone not vote? Did anyone not vote? It's a really close one. Mm. Ah, the gap widens. Oh yeah, there it goes. It's Persona, except you're forging swords instead of Personas. And you need women's affection to forge better swords yeah <laughs> uh i only are deaths interesting for zapar can get the subtitle for their cans uh there are websites for that zapara but this is not one of them it's not one of them all right 12 votes to seven thank you for participating i felt i'd met my soulmates feels the same way I am surprised <laughs> wow <laughs> you got it right I thought for sure that was the wrong answer 
Oh, Thousand Arms. You never cease to surprise us. <laughs> Does love grow when there are more obstacles? This is actually a really poignant question. <laughs> Does love grow when there are more obstacles? <sighs> Don't worry, I'll crush anything that gets in our way. Some things just can't be helped. I don't even know what this means. Some things just can't be helped. Like, oh, you're just gonna fall in love or like, oh, it won't, it'll get in the way. Like, what is this? This is so ambiguous. <laughs> it's gotta be A, right? We'll have a good success with bombs. All right, speaking of, don't worry, I'll crush anything that gets in our way. That's what I feel too, Ravenon. This one feels like it's fatalistic instead of, oh, will you know a kind of hey there's always problems we'll get through them it feels fatalistic like like self-defeating that's my thought so i'm gonna pick a that's not what nelsha asked God, damn it. <laughs> 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 <Fuck>. <laughs> 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 hey dave how are you what's up i've been good how about you how about you? Oh, then we just bombed two questions. Do you think there are things that just can't be done? Do we think that there are things that just can't be done? B is realistic. I know. Is it the right answer, though? <laughs> this is such a crapshoot. Every time, it feels like a coin flip. Uh, uh, oh, Lorelana. How are you? How's the new place? Hopefully, you're acclimating well. Holiday sinus infection, lack of time management. Yeah. Yeah, I had COVID at the beginning of last month. That sucked. That was fun. Can we get through this game? It depends. Yeah. <laughs> I know. We were like, we were killing it in the first couple questions. And then these. I am amused. We went from like getting 15 to 20 votes to five. Vote. Come on. Let's go. I need your help. <laughs> Everyone's like, I don't know what to pick. This one sucks. Uh, we're having anxiety and second thoughts, aren't we? You thought you had COVID? I am 100% positive I had it. Spent the last two days organizing all the school stuff, like bus passes. Nice, nice. Do, 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 do. You're recovering from a recent sickness. I wasn't tested, but my roommate was, and I got it from her. And, and I had not been that sick in years. It was fucking COVID. It was bad. They had diminished my sense of smell. Um, I felt like I had the flu for like a week and a half. I was just like sleeping a ton. It was bad. It was really nasty. Chad is not... Well, Chad is helping. They're just tied right now, okay? Everyone that's voted has helped. <laughs> just because it's not a conclusion conclusive answer doesn't mean they're not helping they're participating in the process and I appreciate that <sighs> I went back yesterday and first day back was tiring I'll bet I'll bet <laughs> it's still tied <laughs> uh, oh that sucks Paul Oh, hey, at least we beat it, right? You need to schedule your booster. Yeah, I gotta get mine sometime this month now, cause it's been more than it's been more than a month since I had it. How do you spell the name of this game? Uh, here. Does that help? This is the game. Let me just show you the logo. Hopefully, that gives you an idea. <laughs> That's how you spell it. Mm 
Yours was pretty bad, but it didn't even last a week before a lot of it started fading. I mean, for me, it was like the flu symptoms were there for about a week, but they, they tapered off extremely slowly. So I'm like still fighting some of the lingering side effects of it. All right, last call for votes here. It's very close. Who's gonna pick? What do we got? She asked if there are things that you can't, some things you can't do, right? Pop out the disc to double check. Sure, no problem. There you go. There's disc one. See, this is what happens when tr people try to be a smart ass. I just throw it back at them. <laughs> uh, oh, got him. B, because kids don't wash dishes. <laughs> oh, man. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Latest data suggests three months. I was told one by the pharmacist. So I don't know. Okay, we're going to say B. 10 votes to eight. Thank you for participating, everyone. Here it comes. It depends. <laughs> That's no fun. This might be a reset. <laughs> Mice, no should think you're a bit masochistic. He probably is. Yeah, he probably is. I'll feel your love even when you're mean to me. I'm just diving in full cheese ball right now. Oh, so you do like that. <laughs> she was like, oh. I think that was a good surprise noise. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. Wait, now which one? To tell you the truth. Well, you know, since you brought it up. <laughs> yeah, it was a softball pitch. <laughs> uh, or I was just teasing you. Oh, my God. Now she thinks Mice is a masochist. I know, right? <laughs> Fuck. I want to pose it to Chan again, but you've gotten every question wrong. <laughs> Not gonna lie, chat. You're batting a 0% right now. <laughs> oh, fuck. Hmm. Commit to the bit. Yeah, I was leaning towards that. <sighs> All right, let's do it. Just, just, you know, no balls, right? Let's go. To tell you the truth. Wow, your mind is set. I don't think that was a good noise. <laughs> Someday my knight in shiny armor will take me away to a big castle. Okay. 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 Chat missed again. Yeah. I think it's better if he's driving a car. Oh my god, he's right in front of you. Just I'm just full cheese dick right now. Really? Where? Where? <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. Oh my god. Oh. The accidental burn. Those those sting even worse. <laughs> Mice, how do you sleep at night? How do you sleep at night? <sighs> Kaboom! Sometimes I hug my pillow. I sleep well if a gorgeous lady is next to me. Oh, shit. Like I said, just fully committing the cheese dick right now. This one has just gone down the tubes. Here we go. I sleep well if a gorgeous lady's next to me. What did you say? Your intimacy level goes down when you say things like that. <laughs> 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 
she just broke the fourth wall. <laughs> oh my god. Sudden cosplay to yell at us. Oh my god, this is such a reset. <laughs> Go home now. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna miss you. Now she's so sorry. She gotta go now. Oh, we fucked that one up so bad. Okay. Oh. Wait, did that go up? It was two. You know, we still gotta reload though. We didn't. It didn't work. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it was four, actually. I think it went from four. Yeah, I think it was four. There you go. You get the free ASMR. There you go. <sighs> yeah, this is a PS1 JRPG dating sim. And the reason you date ladies is because when they have more affection for you, you forge better swords. Legitimate. That's what this game is. It's so weird. It's been days since we've been able to do a, a date, so I saw the opportunity. I had to give us one, you know, and since we bombed that one, we're doing it again. I don't care. I don't care. We're doing it again. We got to win her heart with something. <laughs> I don't fucking know what she wants. <laughs> this woman doesn't even know what she wants. Oh, God damn. It's nice music though, isn't it? It's nice music. Bum 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 bum. Blue. Okay, um excuse me. Chat was battling a thousand during that attempt. It was quite the opposite. Hmm. <laughs> good talk. All right. Yeah, she just dusted us. That was that one went bad. That one went really bad. Did someone clip that fourth wall breaking moment? I don't know. I'm not sure. Teddy bear. Yeah, the teddy bear. We're definitely going to make sure we do that. We'll do the teddy bear. Big teddy bear. Join the battle. How are we doing? 39. We have 17 minutes. We have 39 units in stream raiders. Okay, we're going to need more. All right, have a teddy bear. Oh, no, I wonder what it is. Big teddy bear. Wow, that went better this time. <laughs> mm, I hope you're a plumber because my downstairs just sprung a leak. Someone's being lewd in chat. Thanks for 80 bits, whoever you are. <laughs> Anonymous source. Okay, let's go on a date, Nelsha. Let's go on a date. Let's do it. She likes food, right? Is there a restaurant in this town? A bar, perhaps? You know, she seemed to talk about food. Maybe if we take her to a different place, it'll go better. That's a shop. Where am I on this map? Okay. Oh, I guess we're doing it right here. Date here? No. Ha! Let's see. Let's go down here. It was like a restaurant or something. Do, 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 do. Oh. What do we got? All right, we got a little pub. That'll work. Probably got food, so. The, what is that? The shit shack? <laughs> Nelsha tossed and turn a lot in her sleep. Nelsha tossed and turn a lot in her sleep, chat. Uh, I move around a lot myself. 
Saying I don't like that is just rude. I'm just picking B. I just have to. <laughs> You're such a smooth talker. Not really. <laughs> I am. Mice is not. <laughs> you were in Nelsha's dream last night. Go on. I feel like it's A. A seems like delighted surprise. B seems cocky. Right? Do you get all nervous? Like, that's why I'm parsing that. This one's like, really? Wow. Okay. I got it. I'm picking A. It has to be. It has to be. Let's go with A. Chat. Chat, we're going to go with A. <laughs> You're blushing. You're so cute. Yes. <laughs> that was a good response. <laughs> uh, whew. Okay. Okay. Nelsha wants you to get to know her better. Okay. That's a nice gesture. This? No. Why would you say I think that's enough? Yes. Nelsha just, just said I want to do this, and mice would be like, no. This is basically no. I'd love to, except they spelled two wrong. It's only one O. Yes, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> uh, only this one, Dave. She's the only one that does. She's she's a real nut. <laughs> she's a real goof. Do you like watching romantic movies? Uh, depends. Is it called Say Anything? Because yes. Oh, no. It's got to be this one, right? I, I actually don't know. <sighs> like this one is like, yo, I want to do those things with you. I don't know. I don't know. I dream of romance like that. This one talks directly about romance. This one seems like it's moving forward really fast, but this is also thousand arms. And as we have seen a lot of the times, the common sense answers don't exist. <laughs> Does this set even have movies? We've not seen anything to that effect, no. Oh god, please don't, Zordon. <laughs> oh my god. You're gonna drive everyone nuts if you do that. <laughs> uh, oh man. The fourth wall is transparent. Yeah, it really is. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna throw uh, throw this one to you, chat. I believe in you. It's your this is your redemption arc, chat. It's time to vote. This is your redemption arc. Here we go. What do you vote for? Let's have a relationship like they do in the movies. Type A or one. I dream of romance like that. Type B or two. This is chat's redemption arc. Is this gonna is it gonna work? Is it gonna work? The suspense is killing me. You surprised you just don't have an option like I like cheese? That's always a valid answer to any question, so you know. <laughs> Daft is the right word, I'm telling you. <laughs> uh, you feel she brought it up because she wants to explore this in reality. Yeah, I mean, fair point. Of course, AV has a, a, an emote. Of Nelsha. <laughs> of course she does. <laughs> oh, I gotta tell AV I've been playing this game. <sighs> Had to drop the prime sub. I was not about to watch eight ads for name H E H E. Oh, dude, Dave, thank you so much, man. I did not realize the ads just kicked in. So we'll wait. We're gonna wait. We're gonna wait. I need to do this though. I gotta send this to AV. Where is she? I don't know. Yeah, there she is. There you go. <laughs> there, I sent her. I sent her a DM to show her. 
<laughs> Phoenix, what's up? How you doing? How's it going? How's it going? Do, do, do. Dave, thank you, man. Enjoy those Finny Bear emotes and the ad-free experience. Where are the Pulverones? I have not bought anything sweet in a while because I have ongoing dental work to do. So I'm just like staying away <laughs> until that's all taken care of. <laughs> But I promise you, when that's all done, there will be more pulverones. Cause damn, those are good. You like to say you have faith in chat, but you were here before the console mysteriously reset. <laughs> Yo, cloaked. What's up, man? Uh, doo -doo. I'm doing well. How you been? How you been? What's new with you, Phoenix? All right, chat. What do we got? A lot of you voted. A lot of you voted. 12 votes to 8 currently for answer B. Whoo. With dental work? A lot of dental work. <laughs> I don't want to go into it. It's too much. It's too much. And it's going to just attack my bank account like nobody's business. A lot. It's the side effects of having radiation treatment for cancer years back. miss many things you know sick that was my birthday then yeah there's a lot going on yeah there's been some things yeah refresh to drop that I have to drop this up and kill the ad so I missed the question uh I believe the question was do you want what was it do you want romance or do you like watching romantic movies I think it was do you like watching romantic movies was the question yeah, yeah, there you go. Revenant, yeah. Yep. I'm working, working, working. Yeah, it's nice to see you, Phoenix. Dun, 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 dun. Have you had time to stream at all? Or has work just been like... Work, work, work. Work, work, work. You wanted to drop by my 40th and in true 40 guy style, you fell asleep and didn't wake up till you hit round. <laughs> eh, you know, uh, I don't know. It's weird. Cause I don't feel that old. So I don't know. I don't really understand the big deal about the number, I guess. As far as I'm concerned, I don't feel and look that old. So whatever you either most days fair. The only time I feel that old is when I wake up because what I, the, the thing I sleep on is like a brick freaking wall. It's uncomfortable. Yo, what's up, Blockbuster chick? How's it going? It's a, it's a Glitchco fam there. All right, folks, you have voted. 13 of you chose answer B versus eight for answer A. Is this chat's redemption arc? Do you like watching romantic movies? Asks Nelsha. We're going to say, I dream of romance like that. You think so? It looks tiring to me. You're always full of energy. She didn't make a bad face, so I'll take it. That was a push. That was a push. I'll take it. You know what? It wasn't a loss. It was a push. <laughs> I feel like that was the neutral answer and the other one was the bad answer. So I'll consider it a win. Okay, good job. You pulled it off. <laughs> I'm doing well, Blockbuster Chick. It's good to have you in here. When do you... um? Do you have like a stream schedule? Because I, I haven't caught your stream yet, I don't think. I'm, I get up super late. So if you're like a morning streamer, it's going to be hard for me to stop in. Which, you know, that's the way life goes. You know what I'm saying? The other choice is a bad idea based on that response. Right. Like... She said, oh, they seem like they're too tiring or whatever, right? Right? If we had said, I want that kind of romance with you, that probably was the wrong answer. So I consider that a victory for chat. Good job. It's the start of the redemption arc. Eastern Mondays and Wednesdays, 2 p.m. Eastern. Saturdays, 3 p.m. Eastern. Okay. So I'm usually asleep when you start. So I'll have to look for you when I wake up then sometime. Nelsha says you're always full of energy. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. 
Are you implying I act like a kid? No, why? This is defensive and insecure. This could be playful and funny. With Jensen drank with strong, right? She might think this is silly and funny, right? Do do do. Yeah, Kino, that's what it's gonna be like. <laughs> that's what's gonna happen. Uh, there are cases where all you can do is control damage. Yeah, that's what I feel like is happening with Cyril with some of these. Ginseng drink was strong. I'm picking this. Wow, you're hyper. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> Does the bear shit in the woods? <laughs> uh, do you know what dense means or dense? Oh, these both suck. <laughs> these both suck. Oh, no. Oh, this question's a trap. <laughs> Oh man. Oh. It's got to be A. It's got to be. What else could it be? Oh. There's a cloud of smoke where Mike's was just standing. <laughs> yeah, I know. Rat Burger is like, what's it? Oh, I'm going to go. See ya. <laughs> it's a bear cat. <laughs> oh man. These answers are awful. Uh. All right. Let's just pick A. Do you know what dense means? Dense means smart, right? Then. <laughs> Nelsha must be a smart girl. <laughs> we got it! Yes! <laughs> oh my god, it worked! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I cannot believe this girl. <laughs> Wait, would that mean she'd love the other answer? She probably would have, yeah. She probably would have absolutely loved it. Oh my god. Are you hiding something from Nelsha? Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Are we hiding from something? Chad, are we hiding something? Uh. No, I have nothing to hide from you. But the other girl. Oh, come on. This is just. This, this is. This is the only answer. No. Uh huh. Your eyes are shifting back and forth. Okay, at least she didn't get mad. <laughs> what do you want to do now, mice? Um, I want to hyperventilate and count backwards from ten before I have a panic attack. <laughs> What do these answers mean? <laughs> this is so ambivalent. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I want to phone a friend. Please. <laughs> Please do. <laughs> Shit. Oh, man. Oh. All right, chat. The redemption arc. Here you go. This one's you. Can you, can you pull it off? Can you pull it off, chat? This is your vote. One or A for huh? We're dating, aren't we? Two or B for a little this, a little that. Can you consult a lawyer? I, it might be encouraged, actually, yeah. But uh, you're going to have to cover the cost. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, this one's so bad. Oh, man. The question was literally just, what do you want to do next? That was it. What do you want to do next? And these are the answers. These are the answers. <laughs> uh, 
I feel like if we understood what these answers mean in Japanese, it would be a lot easier. I don't know about that. <laughs> this game is asking yes or no questions and giving you a blank space for an essay. Yeah. Yep. Yep. 86 units. Uh oh. I hope that's enough. There, there does not seem to be a right answer to this, but we're going to have one. It was designed to be difficult to guess. So situations like this would happen. I, I see. Family feud is easier than it is. Oh. A is like the innocent answer, so it might be best for her. Mm. Man, maybe. I don't know. All right. Last call for votes. Last call for votes, and then uh, we'll select. She is dense. Yeah, very smart. Yeah, as we just learned. I mean, it's very smart. <laughs> Wow. Holy smokes. <laughs> wow. Uh, I don't know who that was, but I'm grateful. <laughs> oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. Thank you for the Patreon pledge. Holy smokes. That is going towards paying DMs. Paying DMs to run one shots for our Discord community. So thank you so much. That's exciting. That is exciting. I have much excites. Thank you. Thank you, kind stranger. Actually just change something on that too which should make it work better there we go cool that's yeah that's awesome I'm very very happy for that I hope you if you're out there that you understand that I appreciate that very much and I think the community will too so right on I appreciate that let's select 10 of you voted a six of you voted B to close it out what do you want to do next? Huh? We're dating, aren't we? Nelsha wants to make a sand castle. She is really innocent, isn't she? <laughs> uh, how old are you again? <laughs> Did you know that girls can see what's going on inside people's heads? Ah. <sighs> Um, uh, tell me more. Tell, tell me, tell me more about that. <laughs> uh, is that true? That kind of scares me. Wait, what is this? <laughs> this doesn't make any sense. <laughs> What does this have to do with anything? I bet you are. You crushed that soda can with one hand. What? I wonder if that was like the wrong line put there. <laughs> Is it a bug? Maybe it's a bug. <laughs> uh, should we be one of Lina's answers? Is it a bug? Oh my God. Oh my god. I like the music. I'm just kind of vibing out. You say just go for B? Oh. 
just go for B? We do have to know, don't we? We have to. We have to. Because this doesn't make any sense. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense at all. Oh my goodness. Oh, what the hell? All right, we're going to pick this one. Science. Here we go. <clears throat> It wasn't that one. <clears throat> Do you think it's cool to be an adult? Ow. Oh. Errors have been made. Errors were made, yeah. Do you think it's cool to be an adult? There's no fucking right answer to this, and A is just scary. <laughs> I need to look something up here, right? We're gonna consult the manual. <clears throat> we need to consult the manual. This is a problem. Okay, let's get a little context. Mice is 16. Okay, he's 16 years old. Sodina is 15. Okay. Why not is 17. Okay. Kylene is 16. And Nelsha. Quote. Appears to be 12. Unquote. Can I just push the reset button now? <laughs> She doesn't look 12 when she cosplays, but what the fuck? <laughs> now I'm like, is this one of her cosplays? Like, I don't even know who you are, woman. Jesus. <sighs> B, why do you want to be an adult so badly? Nelsa don't want to be an adult, but... But... It was really fun. Let's go out again. Did... Did we... Did we win? Did... Did we win? Mm -hmm. We did it! <laughs> That's for you, chat. <laughs> Run! <laughs> yeah. It's always like, run! Just get up! <laughs> oh my god, that was awful. That was our worst one yet. That was the most uncomfortable one of all of them. <laughs> god. Intimacy level changed the three. Okay. Jeez. Jeez, man. She's too much. She's too much. <laughs> She's just too much. <laughs> <laughs>